been made for entertainment purposes only. The actions shown in this game do not reflect the opinions and views of the Matt West Gaming Channel, nor are they an actual representation of any and all real-life law enforcement agencies. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everybody, Matt West Gaming, back with an episode of LSPDFR. Today we're going to be doing a Polito patrol in the evening, using this Polito Township Police Crown Vic that we found on LSPDFR.com. As ever, I'll leave a link to my video description if you guys want to check it out afterwards. Right, let's show ourselves a bed and we'll get out there so we can get into tonight. A bit foggy, but we're going to try our best. Sam297. This is dispatch. Show me 104108. Roger that, Sam297. Proceed to patrol area. Then guys, let's get up there. Try our PRs on in case we catch anybody with dodgy plates. That's it, Polito. It's a very foggy evening this night. Got anything for us? Dispatch. We've got a disturbance in Palato Bay. Oh, no, just code three. That, man. Sam 297, show me responding code 3. 10 4, Sam 297. Neighbor dispute responding code 3. Let's go. Sam 297, show me 23, Procopio Drive, eastbound 3023. Roger, Sam 297, proceed with caution. Hello there, sir. Uh, Deputy West Blaine County Sheriff's Office, what appears to be going on here this evening? Christopher Banks. Hello, officer. I'm glad you came by so quickly. Hello, sir. Can I tell me what's going on? That person over there keeps throwing trash on my property and my car. Since how long has this been going on for? It started recently, maybe like three months ago or something like that. All right, then. Give me a minute to talk to everyone and we'll see what we can do. Right, then. Let's go and talk to the neighbour, shall we? See what we've got going on. Hi there, sir. Officer West Brain County Sheriff's Office. Uh, Jeffrey Rodriguez. Hi, officer. Can you tell this dickhead to leave me and my family alone? Calm down, sir. What's going on here? This motherfucker keeps letting his dog shit on my lawn. So I throw it back on his. I see. I need to check a few things and I'll be right back. Please try to calm down in the meantime. My fucking ride! What are you doing? Hey, come back here, Zeus. Where's Zeus going? Oh my god, Zeus is gonna attack him. Oh my god. Shots fired, shots fired. a couple of times then. And backup didn't really do a lot, did they? Good day. Apart from smash into everything. Not really very helpful, guys. Mm. 
So yeah, he got lit up pretty badly. Let's see, what, let's see who he was. He had anything on him. Weapon skilled anyway. He had an open pack of cigarettes, switchblade, glass breaker tool, and matches. Jeffrey Rodriguez. Sam two nine seven requested twenty seven. Jeffrey Rodriguez ten ten eighty four. No warrants, right? That's right. There's another guy over here. Right. Weapon secured. Well, that that went a bit pear shaped, didn't it, guys? Small value of cough medicine. Citation. Sam 297 requested 27 on Christopher Banks, 230584. Sam 297 requests the EMS Procopio Drive, 3023. Ambulance, assistance okay, required in Palato Bay. Poor doggy. Oh, I suppose he did attack the man. Sam297 requesting animal control. Assistance required in Palato Bay. Get animal control out here for the dog. See if these guys survive. My guess is they probably won't because we chopped them to pieces oh, quite a bit. See about this guy. See if he's. I'm here. As well. It's going to be okay. We'll get Corrin around here. That went a bit, um, that went a bit extreme. If your neighbour just over, all that over some dog, dog mess. A bit ridiculous, eh? <laughs> Sam297 requesting coroner. Assistance required in Palato Bay. Oh, they saved that guy. They saved the guy who got attacked by the dog at least. Didn't save anybody else. Alright, let's get back out there then, guys. Sam 297, show me code 4 on that neighbor dispute back 10 8. Attention, all units. Code 4, no additional officers needed. Alright, then, guys, back to patrol. See what else we can get into tonight. Interesting first call there. All that over some dog poo. Hmm. Need to go up the scale a little bit there. Uh, it's real quiet over here. Available for other business. I'm say, liking this Pleto Bay police brown vehicle looks very nice. Yet to use this one, so we thought we'd give it a go today. Units oh, respond code two. Sam 297, show me responding code 2. 10 4, copy that. Sam 297. Welcome to police station. Let's go, guys. I'm going to head over to Polito PD and see what we've got going on. A person is taking photos of the station to speak with them and find out why. Okay, will do. Where are they then? Can you see them? I can't see anybody. Look up at the front here. Sam 297, show me 23. Roger, Sam 297, proceed with patrol. Hi there, sir. Deputy West, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Can I ask what you're doing here this evening? Hi, what are you doing taking photos of the station? Hi, officer, I'm a huge fan of emergency services and the work they do. I've just been taking some photos of your station, is that okay? If I'm understanding right, your interest in our work is like a side hustle. Correct. I'm a huge fan of what you do. I'm watching all those videos as well on YouTube. Good old LSPDFR, eh? It's just something I enjoy. Fascinating. While well, I was just swinging by, that's all. I can only apologise for wasting your time, but I've finished up my shots anyway. It looks pretty good if I say so myself. Not a problem in the slightest. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. You're better be on my way. 
I didn't. You can't go, mate. I need to stop. Just want to run your ID and check your check you check your own. Just check out, buddy. First, am I right? Right then, sir. Can I see your ID, please? It's good speech. Oh, well, we're an intoxicated person here. Oh, dear. Sam 297 requesting a 27 on Meng Shu. Uh, 22 1183. Disturbance. Sam 297, show me 10-6. Roger, Sam 297. Alright then, sir, when I'm getting some signs of intoxication coming from you. Have you had anything to drink today? I'm sober. When did you last have a drink, sir? Um, six hours ago. Okay. Alright then, sir. I believe you could be intoxicated in public, so I'm going to conduct a few... So your sobriety tests. First test is the horizontal gaze test. I'm going to take out a pen, and I want you to follow the pen with your eyes only. Do not move your head. Do you understand these instructions? Yeah. Okay. Well, the test will begin when I count to three. One, two, three. Oop, failed that one. Right then, sir, and the second test mm -hmm. is the walk and turn test. So I'm going to ask you to walk down walk, step, walk down here. I want to tell you to turn round. You're going to turn round and then walk back to me. Understand these instructions? You do? Okay. Right, let's see, if, let's see if you can do it then. Come on, sir. You could uh, just carry on walking then. See how we get on. Well, no. He's going to be drunk as a skunk, aren't you, sir? <sighs> All from taking photos of the police station. I bet you wish he didn't bother now. <laughs> All right then, sir, if you could just turn and face either direction. I'm afraid you're going to be under arrest for public intoxication. You have the right to remain silent and you say... Can it will be against in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, we'll provide you free. Understand these rights that I've read to you. This is bullshit. Okay. Right then, sir, for your safety and my safety, I'm going to search you. Is there anything on you that could harm me, stick me, poke me in any kind of way? Any guns, knives, etc.? No? Okay, well, we'll find that there is. Nothing of interest. You got nothing on you, sir. That's the first. And so I'm going to pop you in the back of my cruiser, which is just over here, conveniently parked just over here on the car park of the PD. We just take you straight in, couldn't I? But we'll do the charges first, don't we? Now let's pop you in my rear seat, shall we? Get in, sir. At least we haven't got to go far to drop you off, eh? I think we might actually drop you off ourselves today. He was by driving license, but he wasn't driving, so there we go. He has no criminal record, which is a shame. So you should you should get off then for this, sir, then, to be honest. Got no uh, previous. They should let you off pretty easily. Right then, sir, should we take you back to the station? We've got a long way to go. Right, let's take you back ourselves, shall we? Put our seatbelt on, even though we're only just going around the corner. <laughs> we'll have to go in this disabled space, won't we? Oh, oh, there. It'll merge, it'll merge me into the station. Let's park here, shall we? All right, and so if you want to step out. Yeah, step out. Thank you. Take your time. I'll take you down to the south, sir. Let's shut the door as well. Right then, let's go then, guy. Let's go into Polito. 
I like this one because it's actually got an interior we can actually go in. There we go. Let's take him, let's take him to the sows. You can uh, spend a night in the drunk tank, mate. Yeah. Let right, you out in the morning when you've sobered up. Let's pop you in here, sir. Right, you're going to remove handcuffs now, okay. Stay here. There you go, sir. Right. Hopefully you sober up and you, they release you in the morning. Have a good sleep. Sleep it off. And we're going to get back out there, guys. Let's go. Sam297, show me code for back 10-8. Let's get back to the car. Attention all there. units. Code for no additional support needed. Let's get back out there, guys. On the mean streets of Pinto we Bay. We have oh, a disturbance dear. in Palato Bay. Units respond code 3. Sam 297, show me responding code 3. 10 4, Sam 297. Well, we're off again. Domestic disturbance this time. A bit different. See what's going on this time. I've done this call out before, so this could be interesting. Everybody. Let's lower our code three. So which house is it gonna be? Is it gonna be this one here? Wrong. This one here. Sam 297, show me 23 Procopio Drive 3014. Oh, we went over the road earlier. 10-4. Got more going on tonight, guys. Let's see what's going on. We, we torch out. Let's see what we've got going on at this house. Press X to ring the doorbell, okay? You rang the doorbell. Oh, hello. Hi, sir. Hello there, sir. Deputy West Blaine Town Sheriff's Office. Hello, sir. We got a call about loud noises coming from your house. Oh, that must be a mistake. Nothing is wrong here. Maybe you've got the wrong address. So, I'm going to need to check the address, if that's all right, to make sure. So, I have to make sure everything is ordered. Would you please let me in? Don't you need a warrant for that? Since there might be something criminal going on right now, I can mm -hmm. enter without a warrant. Are well, you were defensive about it. Okay, come in. Hello there, sir. Right. All right, hang tight for me. I'm going to take a look around the property. Yeah, whatever. All right. All right, let's see what we got going on then, shall we? Oh. That doesn't look good. I can't see him. Sam two nine seven shots fired. Assistance needed in San Andreas. Weapon secured. Copy, this is Adam Six, on our way. Oh my god. Good Bobcat 4, we're in route. Sam 297 requests an EMS. On Procopio Drive. Ambulance, assistance required in San Andreas. Let's see if we can help her out. Couldn't see her in the other view. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Hey, we treated her successfully. Hey, ma'am. I think your partner might have assaulted you, so... Um, unfortunately, there's been a bit of an incident in the other room. But you're, you're well, so that's good. 
Well, let's go and check him. Yeah, he's down. I guess he killed a weapon. Weapon secured. Give him a search if he's got anything else on him that he shouldn't have. The reason why he got some shots in is I couldn't see him. Oh, there's an X. There's an X button to search the body as well. Louis Hubbard. Dispatch suspect is down over. Roger that. Medical services have arrived at your zone. Ambulance has arrived on scene, guys. What else have we got here? We've got any other scene? We've got a full scene out here. Whoa, where are you going? There you go. Okay, right. Sam 297, show me code 4 back to name. Attention all units, code 4, no interesting additional call. officers needed. Right, let's see if we can do a traffic stop, guys. Show me this guy over here. Right, let's check him out. Because he's in top of the head. I oh, know he's carrying a weapon. I'm 1096 with a driver. Better send a record. We're pounding his car. I copy. Send a record now. Show me 23 Polito Boulevard 3016. A person with a weapon. Copy that. Sir. So we need to drop the drop that weapon, sir. Say so listen to me. Drop the weapon. Sir, so drop that weapon and get down on the ground. Get down on the ground. Well, don't you move, sir. Don't you move. Show one in custody. Attention all units. Suspect apprehended. All right, sir. Take you back to the hood of my car. I'm going to investigate what's going on here, shall we? Mm -hmm. Right, sir. Do you mind telling me what was going on? Can you ask, can I ask why you're carrying a weapon? I plead the fifth and no more questions. Whose weapon's this, sir? What's up? It's mine. Okay, we're gonna get some backup out here. Sam 297 requesting code 2 backup. 10-4. Assistance required right. on Palenco Get a backup Boulevard. unit out here, guys. Right then, for your safety and my safety in the search, you was anything on you can harm me, stick me, poke me in any kind of way. I need more weapons on you, sir. Any narcotics, etc. Several small baggies of methadone, glass pipe loaded with marijuana, delicious pills in a bottle. Hey. Hi, buddy. Just watch our suspect here while I go and run these drugs. I'll be back with you shortly. There's a new sheriff unit here. What's going on? Not on patrol. Right, let's run these narcotics, guys. We've got, we got pills in a bottle. Uh, MDMA. Yes. We're in. Fentanyl. It's, he's got fentanyl on him, so methadone and fentanyl. Let's pop you in the back of the car, sir. I'll keep him 
busy. Yep, you keep him busy. Let's get a pet check on him. Question 27, Edward Green, 02, 1994. Expired driving license, right? Well, he's going to jail, buddy. No doubts about it. We need backup. We need backup. You are backup, you fool. <laughs> right, so we got we got a methadone. Uh, methadone. We ha also have the fentanyl, and we have. Branching a firearm. She said he was intoxicated. How would do that? Possession of firearm with intoxic while well, intoxicated. There we go. Let's go with that. Who's that? I don't know who she is. Anyway, we've got Edward. We got old Edward, so there we go. <laughs> Sam 297 requesting PT. Assistance required. Right, you can take him, guy. Thank you. Boulevard. Right, you can. There we go. Him then. 724, I'm going off. Inbred dick That's not very friendly. Sam 297, show me 10 6. Roger, Sam, two, ninety-seven. Right, back to it. Let's get back out there then, guys. Got old Edward off the streets. It's a slow night, guys. It's a slow night. Not been a slow night for me. Everything's been going on in Palito tonight. Right, let's see what else we can get. Let's try one... Let's do one more thing, guys. We'll make this a bit of a longer episode than normal. Just want to say a big thank you to everybody for my likes, comments, subscribes to my channel. It's greatly appreciated. If you like this style of contact content, don't forget to smash that like button on this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already for more videos in this style coming to the channel soon. Right then, let's see if we can pull over a car. Done that for a while. That's always interesting. Just gotta find somebody, one somebody that's breaking the law. This car just run the red light, so we're gonna get them. Seven, show me on a 1011 Procopio Drive, northbound 3011. 10-4, Sam, 297. Proceed with caution. Let me see what we've got going on, guys. Hi there, sir. Officer, uh, Deputy West, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Reason we pulled you over today is she run a red light back there. Right, could I see your driving license registration proof insurance, please? Thank you. Okay, Mr. Payne, you just hang tight while I go and check your details through the police computer. Would you just shut off your engine for me? Right, I'm just going to go run your details through, sir, and then we'll get you back out on the road, hopefully soon. Bear with me. Let's see what we've got going on. Oh, Mr. Payne. Mr. Payne running a red light. Naughty Payne. 55, Brian Payne. Valid insurance, passing on the blah, 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 blah. Stop four times. Lives on Dalpero Freeway. Oh, okay, busy. Okay, right. Let's get a back of the union. Assistance needed in Palato Bay. Just in case Mr. Payne tries to get Roger, dispatch 27 on route to assist call 3. This is uh, 99. Nine. Got two males here. Uh, it looks like they beat each other up pretty bad, but neither one suppressed charges, so I'm clear now. Over. 
Might be an L4 Taurus out. Nice car. Placement for this. Hey. Ironically. Hey John, you still in Unit 526? Hey buddy, thanks for coming out here tonight. Hola. Right, you ready? Come on, let's go and see what he's got going on. Hi there, sir. Well, everything checks out. You haven't had a drink today, have you, sir? Not anything to drink, have you, at all? No. When was your last drink? Nothing today. I've been at work since 8am. Okay, sir. That's great. Brilliant. All right, then, sir. Just hang tight with this officer. I'll be back with you shortly. You get a ticket, I think, because he's been stopped four times, so he's there. Uh... There you go, we'll print him off a ticket. Back to and we're going to check out the charges for tonight. Hello there, Mr. Payne. Right, I've got an issue with citation for running that red light back there. Now you've had four previous stops. This probably is going to be about probably about $150. Um, this is not an omission of guilt, it's just say you've received a ticket off myself tonight. Could you sign this for me, please? Thank you. On the back, there's a number for general inquiries. Also, will it be your court date and time and where you need to go? Okay, then, sir. When I, once I return to, once me and my deputy return to our vehicles, you're free to leave. Have a safe trip, and don't forget to stop at those red lights. Okay. Thanks, then, sir. Goodbye. And let's go. Thanks for your, thanks for your help, deputy. You're a brilliant help. Just me, sir. Get rid of him. Sam two nine seven. Show me ten seven ten forty two. Have a good night. Roger, Sam 297. Let's check out tonight's charges, guys, and see what we've got. So we got Mr. Payne here who stopped at the red light. He got 162. 100. Okay, so we've got Mr. Payne here. He got a $126 fine. Right. And then we've got previous man who had possession of meth. Possession of fentanyl and firearm, and a possession of firearm while intoxicated. He stopped him outside the gas station, if you remember. He got one year in prison for possession of fentanyl, granted probation for the other two, and a fine of $1,580. And then we've got Mr. Meng Shu, who's got public intox. He got no prison time and a fine of $66. Right, that's going to conclude today's patrol. Thank you all for watching. Thank you for the likes, comments, and subscribes again. They're greatly appreciated. Any questions, drop them down in the comments below, and I'll try my best to answer them. And I'll catch you all on the next patrol. Stay safe, everybody. Bye.